Now keeping you and your family safe. This is Two Works For You Weather, certified most accurate. Well, we've basically gotten no rain all year, and now it looks <laughs> like we're going to get a ton of it in just a short amount of time. Hopefully. Huh? You know, this is going to be the most rain we've easily seen in over a month, and uh, basically the first rain we've seen of the year, and mm -hmm. we will certainly take it as all it's right. going to be time. moving on in. Here's some of the new information. Looking over some of the morning computer model data, Taft Price and I, we're going to see thunderstorms tonight. Rain will be possible in green country between 8 p.m. and midnight. Now, this certainly doesn't mean cancel your outdoor plans, but this is when we could see some rain moving in. But most of the rain and the heaviest of the rain will be moving in between midnight and noon. As far as your forecast for today, we've also raised the high temperatures as the air is dry and we're taking a while to cloud up. 60 at noon, 65 at 5, and thunderstorm chances toward 10 p.m. and 50 degrees. 56 right now and a really beautiful morning across green country with the blue sky breezy east and southeast wind at 16 miles per hour temperatures were all in the 50s now after beginning the morning near freezing coffeeville's at 57 54 toward grand lake prior tahlequah 55 old mulgee 58 in McAllister. will have a southeast wind today breeziest during the afternoon of near 15 to 20 miles per hour now one thing you will notice tonight the wind is going to gradually become more east that is out ahead of that approaching area of low pressure Pressure, which will be moving in from the west. Now, two features that we're watching, we're now starting to see some thunderstorms developing down in Texas. This is where the bulk of the moisture is located. It's going to take a while for the local humidity levels to increase across green country. Eventually, we're going to see the rain spreading into the southern and western parts of the state and then approaching the Tulsa area later on this evening. We'll show this to you in the computer model forecast. You can see the dry conditions we have now and that wind arrow from the southeast meaning a southeast wind. So we're in for a breezy and pleasant and dry afternoon. 5 p.m. today, dry and green country. So your outdoor plans will be fine. If you're traveling west or south, you may be driving into rain. At 5 p.m. today, showers and storms possible toward Dallas. At 10 p.m. tonight, the thunderstorms will approach green country. And then after midnight is when we're going to see the bulk of that rain moving in. 65 the high for today with a southeast wind of 10 to 20 miles per hour. Temperatures around the rest of green country. We have warmed these up since the morning news. 63 Bartlesville, 65 in Grove. 66 prior, 66 Tahlequah, upper 60s to near 70 toward McAllister. Then it's going to rain tonight. This will be a near 100% chance for rain. As far as rainfall totals, one inch rainfall total should be common. Some of you may get two inches of rain. We will generally see less rain and lighter amounts toward southeastern Kansas, and the precip will be staying as rain as will be staying well above the freezing mark. Seven day forecast bulk of the rain will be falling tonight night through the first part of Wednesday, though we will still see areas of at least light rain, light to moderate rain in green country, especially south and east of Tulsa, into Wednesday afternoon, and a few showers could be lingering even into early Thursday. With the clouds and rain, we will be cool tomorrow. 40s on Wednesday, struggling to get out of the 40s on Thursday. 55 by Friday, 46 for the high on Saturday, and 47 on Sunday with lows in the 20s. So we're expecting kind of cool to cold weather for the weekend. Right now, though, the big eye will be for tonight, watching the rain and thunderstorms. And we'll have much more on the rain coming up a little later on in the newscast. All right, we'll look forward to that. Thanks, George.